the background story of the ballet is that um, it is a coronation of um, Peter II and the score André Richetin found is produced for this occasion. And in this time, the dramaturgy of a coronation ballet was an allegory. And an allegory is a thing where you can bring almost everything together with everything. Politically, Russia got a European power by establishing itself at the, at the sea. And, and Petersburg was a city where this happened. And uh, Peter II was brought up at the, at the seaside. So I decided to speak about all life from um, the point of view of people who live near the water. Unfortunately, the original libretto is away. We, nobody can find, find it. But this is, this is quite often. But we have the score. And if you know the structure, the way how Baroque ballets were structured, and you have the score, you have more than half. So what we do is what we call in Germany Nachdichtung. It's a reasonable way to tell a story on the base of this score, and we follow this score number by number with careful anal analysis, and the, and the ballet, um, the music tells a lot. Of course, I start with the score and I analyze the dance types which the compose, composer is using. And from this, I start, I know what kind of dance was danced to what kind of dance type, and then I start to de decide what to do. And in this score, it is really special because Roman is a person who mixes up. Um, dozens of styles and that makes this um, music beautiful, interesting and also a bit com complicated and this was my thrill to work with this music. Contemporary public needs one interesting thing after each other. There are lots of numbers in this uh, program which are less, less than one minute. So um, <clears throat> this, this, this time and um, the um, 
way these people like to get entertained was not as far from contemporary as we think. And the other thing, what I really like in this is that it is changing proportions all the, all the time. From, from my point of view, having um, 51 minute numbers, one after each other, it's boring. You get tired after 10 of them. And this, this score is mixing be between numbers which are 45 seconds with numbers which are almost 10 minutes. I am never as afraid that um, Baroque entertainment or Baroque stage art can't get, can't catch con contemporary audience. It is also um, an entertainment and an interesting thing for people who lo live nowadays and it's not um, meant as a historical research program.